Yes, yes, boys, it's time for another Dokken video now. And in this video today, guys, we are going to be checking out the green guy himself, my boy Piccolo, hashtag Team Namekians, please. And we're going to see how he does with the new link changes. Now, we got a team built up for him now, and I'm going to show you up the team, which is going to be the Namekian slash worthy rivals team now how am i going to run him at the beginning i'm going to run him with nail to see how it does but maybe later on i will transform one piccolo but not transform the other and see how that runs now here i've got a support unit here for the worthy rivals which you know gives 30 percent attack and defense and then i've just got a vegeta rotation on the other side you know why not why not and yeah this is the team we're going to be using in the you already know you already know, we're going to that infinite Dragon Ball history and we're going to see how they do over there again. Uh, also, do want to let you guys know, if you do like Dokken content, because I know some of you boys really are a fan of Dokken content, definitely do hit that like and subscribe button, guys. It does really help me out and, you know, you get to see all this Dokken content. Let's go. With the link, Jay. Let's go. Okay, let's see how this is gonna be i've been waiting to do this showcase for ages so i'm a big fan of the namekians as some of you boys know and let's see how it goes okay first rotation looking really bad actually um gonna need to get a nail on float asap and yeah because this rotation is done of course which is okay but this is not what we're here for we're not here to be seeing these guys i mean these guys of course are going to be pretty nice maybe i can do a video of these guys on 170% maybe if you want to see that but we're gonna be able to see what them Piccolo is doing because Piccolo is heavily heavily underrated because he doesn't get the highest attack stats I know but still kind of discredit him just because that okay only two links so he's not gonna be hitting the craziest here you boys will understand but let's see what he can hit anyway let's go Okay, so we're going in 1.7 untransformed. Yeah, that's fine. Remember, this guy's a tank as well. So 1.7 untransformed is actually crazy. I mean, he has got a support unit with him. But still, but still. And this guy's not going to hit much. He did not get slapped. And 1.7 from this guy as well, of course. And yeah, okay. So what I'm seeing that as all the way damage. That's all the way damage. By the way, let me know in the comments. Have you got Piccolo? And if you have, do you use him? And if you have not got Piccolo, do you want him? And maybe answer that after the video, just so you know, you can see what he can do. Let's see where it goes. Okay, so this rotation, of course, is going to be stupidly strong. It is the Vegeta rotation. This rotation is mainly used in, like, Infinite Dragon Ball Histories or Legendary Goku event. If you're ever struggling, this rotation usually can get it done for you quite easily. But now we got the boys... Okay, look at them links, look at them links. Okay, I'm going to do one without hit. I'm going to do one first without transformation, just so we can see how it works. So let's go. We're going to see a bit of nail as well. My boy nail going in. So 2 million. Definitely a step up. Which, that is a really solid number, considering he's just pure... T he's raising defense while doing this. 1.68 from nail. Nail stacks as well. This rotation takes no damage, by the way, yeah, so... Double digits when he has type advantage, yeah. That makes all the sense. And we're gonna take him out quick time and let's see how this goes now. Oh, we get that Super Saiyan Blue Evolution transformation kind of early on into the event. That's not what you actually want to see. You kind of want him to stay just normal Super Saiyan Blue for quite a while. Just so he can stack up more of that defense, but now, no defense stack, but he, you know, he's still on what, 111k? That, that should be enough, that should be enough. And uh, yeah, as you can see, the enemy will launch a super attack right at the end there, because Piccolo was able to check that out. And of course, Piccolo would not take any damage from it anyway, because he's been raising his own defense. But let's see how that goes. Okay, so we're going to hit him up. Going to get some crits. Ah, no crits, no crits. Remember, I am trying to time this kind of, because, you know, the fastest I have done this Infinite Dragon Ball history in the series is, I think, 10 minutes, 21 seconds. 
Will this be the team to beat that? I do not think so, I'm not going to lie. That's not be, being nasty against Piccolo, it's just, you know. The team's good, but the team is not like, you know, it's no transformation boost, you know, there's no strength cooler, there's no LR, Vegito, Gogeta, Jiro, you know. Yeah, oh, okay, so he did a bit of damage, not too much, but you know what we're going to hit it with now? Let's go. Transformation. Well, assimilation. <laughs> Let's go. Oh, this is so clean. And now we have that built-in crit chance. We got the chance to stun. Oh, it's all kicking off now. Yeah, got all those links active. 295k defense. That is a bit of help from 17, but still. Remember, there's no support. This guy does not give attack. So 17 not giving attack. What are we looking at? 2 million. Okay. That is all right. Because remember, you do give this guy additionals because he has a high chance to crit. And the way he is built, he probably will not be taking any damage as well. So honestly, you know, that ain't too bad. That is not too bad. We need to see how that looks where we do get the Beerus on that rotation as well. I'm pretty sure that could be a nice looking rotation. But we're going okay fast as well. This guy's been getting super attacks every single time now. So this guy should be doing some damage. And remember, I think the worthy rival section is only 150%. So, uh, these units do some damage on 150. I can't wait to see how he's tanking though. I want to see the tank of him. You know, I think I will transform the other one afterwards. And yo, this Super Saiyan Blue Evolution. Link changes kind of help him out as well, to be honest. I mean, the extra damage is always nice, considering he does like a lot of attacks. But all of his attacks get a bit buffed up, which is pretty nice. And can the passive activate Beerus? No, it did not. But can I get that crit just to end this quick time? No, I did not. Okay. Okay, so we get the Namekian boys. And you know what? Let's see how they link like this. I could do it like that and have every single link active. I'll do it. I'm gonna do it like that. Every single link active now. Let's keep one untransformed, one transformed. I will be pushing Nail off to the side, unfortunately. But you know, let's see how it goes. So, no support again. Linked up with pretty much itself, but this works. This works. 2.18. Okay. Bit of an increase, but that was the other one. I did not actually use the proper one, so. 2.18 on that one, that is crazy. Next rotation is going to be disgustingly strong as well. I think I'd kill him here, honestly. Like, this with docking attack should be enough. Okay, let's go, let's go. This is going to be so 150%. No support, but it's on a 5 million attack stat for the nuke. Ah, uh, let's head it in now. Okay, if we can get a crit heal, maybe an additional super, yo, this is gonna do crazy amounts. Okay, so again with that punch. Let's see how it's doing. Additional, ah, no, additional, no, nothing. Ah, okay, so it's okay. 2.19, no support for this guy still, though. Hopefully we kill him here, because I want to see the attack stats on both of the Piccolos next turn. Yeah, we kill him here. We can... As long as 17 doesn't, like, do minimal damage. 1.5 mil attack, that should be enough for this, I'm sure. Yes, okay. Okay, now this is where it gets good. This is where it gets really good. So this is going to be like the best rotation we will see. The best rotation. He's super attacking at the beginning as well, we can see here. So, I'm going to put it like this. 293k defense, 320k defense, just all links active. We're going to see hopefully some good attack stats, hopefully some good attack stats. Let's see and let it ride. Okay, maximum efficiency right here. Taking triple digits on that. How much am I going to take here? Only 50 from the suit. 2.97. High chance to crit. Like... And 2.51 from the base form Piccolo. Yo. 
That is actually crazy numbers. Concerning how good they are of unit, of course you may not want to run it like this. Maybe you would want Nail back on the rotation purely because you want to have one Piccolo on each rotation most of the time. Just because you can then see the super attacks on both of the rotations. And that is really important because seeing where the enemy attacks come is like 80% of the damage you will take is from the super attack. So if you can always counter their super attacks, technically the game is like easy mode, easy mode. Okay, and yeah, we're going to take him like that. Well, we're getting all right time, we're getting all right time, I think. I think we're like 10 minutes into the video now and... Okay, maybe we're not doing that good actually. Still, it's a bit annoying that there's loads of strength here when I've got two physical leaders. Ah, 1.47 from Nail though. Honestly, I've always wanted a dupe in my AG on Nail. Honestly, I just never got it. Considering how much stones I've put into the banners as well, that's really weird. They're gonna put Piccolo there because no matter how much damage this guy would do, Piccolo will not take it. Piccolo just tanks easily. And no support this time, but still in the 2.61. For a defensive unit getting this high, where well, he does like everything. Unfortunately, no. Oh, 2.82. Okay, so he's got. Because remember, he does raise it, so that's also why you do want to go additionals because. Now it's a bit more damage, so 2.6 into 2.8, that is going to do it without any crits needed. And now we move on to Gohan. I don't want to do this. Okay, we're going to hit this. Yeah, so some people have asked me, do I think Piccolo will be on the 350 million download celebration banner as well? Someone has asked me that question. And... Honestly, I don't think he will be. I don't think he will be. I think the next time we will see him. I don't know the next time we'll see him, honestly. I mean, we have a chance, but I think in the download celebration, I will do a proper video on this. But it's looking like we're going to get maybe a uh, int future Gohan on one of the banners and strength cooler on the other banner while splitting up both the Super Saiyan 2s as well. So in future Gohan and Super Saiyan 2 Goku on one banner, Strength Cooler and Super Saiyan 2 Vegeta on the other banner. I think that's a definite way of them doing it. It's a bit annoying because I want Strength Cooler the most, but I need Super Saiyan 2 Goku. So it's going to be a bit iffy for me. It's going to be a bit iffy. So look, yeah, look, look how much the so 222 and then 276. So he links up so much more when he's linked up with himself. Of course, that's usually how it works, but still. There's a crazy amount. And let's see how this goes now. He's not super attacking me this turn. Because remember I got eyes on the super attack. I'm not taking no damage. Gonna hit him with this. Come on give me that crit. I got that 40% crit chance extra on this. So but really surprising that did not crit there. But you know. It'd be like that sometimes. This guy's gonna go in no crits anywhere. Oh god. Thankfully Nail can come in and do some damage though. Nail's gonna hit him with that combo. Real nice super attack as well from Nail. I really do enjoy the super attack. 1.88. Like it's quick and it's, it's quite unique. Quite unique. Okay, and we make it to the int stage. By the way, I don't think I've used an item in this. Which is uh, quite surprising. I mean, usually you see me use teams with LRs and stuff like that. And you see me using items. But this team is like one of the best teams for like no iteming things. I'm pretty sure this exact team I've taken now could probably no item the legendary Goku event. Maybe switching off the Grand Beerus or something else. But other than that, yeah, this team I think could definitely do it. 2 and 19 here. Let's do the Adam. Okay, and finally, we're not fighting a strength unit. So the Piccolo units with the Beerus next rotation is about to go insane insane oh don't do too much damage to me though ah no because the way the piccolo units work is the higher your hp the higher your crit chance so me taking a bit of damage there does hinder the crit chance quite you know a little bit but then again namekian heals namekian heals i'm already back up at full 
Uh, yeah, don't know how to really go over that, but let's go now. This is the rotation. We should be seeing that 2.97. Is it 2.9? Yeah, 2.97. Pretty much 3 mil. 3 mil. Add no crit. Oh, 3. Yo. 3.9 into 3.2? Is this Kefla? Is this Kefla? This is like. Oof. And we get that damage in. We get that damage in. So there you have it, the last rotation gave us the additional and we got to see that damage come through in a disgusting fashion. Holy. I don't even know anymore man, did you see that damage? What was the time? Because remember this team is not known as being one of the better type teams anyway, so it's not going to be the craziest. 1401, honestly. That's not bad at all. That is not bad for this type of team. That is crazy. And I need to thank you guys for watching. This is near the end of the video now where I give my honest thoughts. And really? Oh, I just want to look at these stickers as well. But as a unit, I feel like he is amazing. I don't like him as a leader though. I feel like he could be like on a better team. Maybe when they bring out like a regeneration category, that's when he will like fit in. But still, he is ridiculous. He like carries you so hard through content because he takes no damage he can see super attacks he can he's like literally one of the best additions helping new people out in Dokken like if you have this guy and say if you have anywhere near this team you can clear anything anything that you know requires difficulty any infinite dragon ball history stage legendary goku event without this guy maybe because you know he doesn't tank but the rest of them no item you can probably do it i think i've done it before and obviously goes well with Nail, which is a non dock Fest exclusive. But yes, a really amazing team. If you have not got Piccolo, I hope this video shows you that maybe you want to get at least one copy. So you can do that trick, like take a Rainbow Friend, but transform the Rainbow one just to get that big damage. And yeah, that is my opinion. Really good unit. I'm not too keen on him as a leader. But yes, yeah, solid nevertheless. Uh, this has been Kizan here. I hope you have enjoyed. Please like and subscribe if you have not. And I'm about out now. See you in a bit, dudes. Goodbye.